What is going on everybody? Welcome back. To begin this episode, I wanna apologize for the lack of content. Uh, like I was saying in my short, I ended up getting sick. There was some content that I had um, when I was putting, making this, the kitchen drawer together. I'm not a 100% sure with what happened to the, the footage. Um, I seem to have either deleted or it didn't record, which I'm pretty sure it did record. No, it did record but something happened to it, I, I couldn't find it. So I'm just gonna give you guys an update on what I did. The frames have been painted and I used uh, Rust-Oleum Flat Black. Uh, also, I'm gonna be showing you guys here in a second on what my mounting solution is. Um, it's basically this. It's gonna be mounted to one of the bolts there for the seat. Uh, we'll see when we get there. So the idea for today is I wanna get at least the recovery drawers into the truck. So that means that we need to put the sliders back on this frame and then screw in the drawer and then I'll be happy. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead, get into it and start working. All right, so as you can see, this is where I decided to put in the, the mounting solution uh, or the anchor. Uh, so there's that L bracket that we made, bolted the this ratchet piece that I took apart and I cut the strap down to the size that I need. Came over here, wrapped around the bar, hooked it right here and uh, oh. <laughs> it doesn't want to move, man. And so that's a good anchor right there. I'm going to do the same thing on that side for the kitchen drawer, but uh, yeah, there it is. Ugh. There you go. So I have to get the plywood on this side and on top done. I have the plywood over here. Um, that will be wrapped with probably marine grade carpet. So I'm trying to get something to about the sim similar color to as what the OEM factory carpet is. Uh, I still have access to this right here. Everything that I need. I can get, I can get in here. No problem. Inverter, fuses, 12 volt. And then... Uh, yeah.
we're mounting the barbecue to the drawer so that way it doesn't shake around and go loose all over the place. Uh, I actually am taking off the footings. And then I'm seeing right here that there's some solid plastic right here. So I'm trying to drill straight through onto the other side as such. And then I've traced the, the footing on as best as I could. And then after I just drill it right through the hole so that way I can go from underneath and I can go ahead and secure it with a couple of stainless steel screws so that way the barbecue is not moving it around. So that is the idea and it looks like it's working out all right. So uh, let me go ahead, finish this up and uh, just show you guys on how it looks. Now pull. There you go. <laughs> it's a little heavy, isn't it? <laughs> All right, so that is it for the video, everyone. I hope you guys enjoyed it. First time using this drawer system. I know that I was uh, doing the barbecuing there, but what did you think about it? I really like that. Yeah? Mm -hmm. I know it's gonna be an ongoing thing. There's gonna be a lot of changes. Uh, there may be things that we will need to add. There may be things that we don't like or take away, but uh, definitely this is like an ongoing journey for us mm -hmm. so that we can dial in to the drawer that we need for our style, uh, which I'm very excited. But as of right now, what I'm really happy with is the, the cutting board. That cutting board is massive. And let me tell you guys, mm -hmm. uh, the fact that we got it for a decent price, it was like $25 on Amazon. Uh, I think it was a huge score. Mm -hmm. Also the, the barbecue. Um, mm -hmm. The fact that we were able to screw the barbecue into the drawer, there was no rattling at all, was there? No. Yeah, it was pretty quiet. Uh, the other thing that I'm going to do, and it's going to be a major change, is the the gas line. Uh, right now, I have the gas line going through the, the, the fascia, mm -hmm. and it doesn't look so nice. So what I would like to do is um, change the nipple of the gas valve or the gas stem that's inside the, the barbecue mm -hmm. off to the side and then run a gas line sort of to the back and then have like a quick release, like an RV propane quick release. I think that'll, I that'll think that'll do. Cool. Yeah. So we enjoyed showing you guys what we've done. A huge thank you to Vadania. I'm telling you guys, I, I'm completely impressed with these drawer sliders by Vadania. Uh, check them out. I'll leave their information in the description below. Have any questions? Again, leave them down in the description below. Until then, stay safe. Who knows? Maybe we'll see you out there.